Hi guys, welcome to the Mythic Booster channel. We've just told you all about the imminent Halloween Pokemon Go Generation 3 event. And I'm going to tell you now all about the Generation 3 dark Halloween Pokemon that are going to be coming to this event and everything you need to know. So stick around, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in a bit. Okay guys, so as I said, we are going to go through all the Generation 3 Ghost type Pokemon that you need to know about. Obviously we don't know what their moves are going to be yet because they're not in the game, but we can tell you some of their stats and so on and so forth. So here we go, let's get started. Pokemon new Generation 3 type thing, type Ujima Flip number 1 is going to be Pokemon number 302 and that is Sableye, who is a Ghost Dark type Pokemon. And to give you a lowdown on its stats, its stats are going to be attack of 141. I am reading this from the computer. My brain is not that good. The attack is going to be 141 for attack, 141 for defense, and 100 for stamina with a maximum CP of 1305. So, not a great Pokemon, unfortunately. <laughs> There's a bit going to be a bit of a theme here with this one. They're new. That's going to be so cool. The only problem is, is they're going to drop them. They're probably going to be absolutely everywhere. So to get one of each is going to take seconds. Anyway, next is going to be 353, and that is going to be Shuppet, who is just a ghost type Pokemon. It's got an attack of 138, a defense of 66, and stamina 88 with a lowly 872 CP. They really need to ditch CP because it doesn't mean anything at all. You know, the attack, defense, and stamina stats are far more important, and that's what we want to know about. Anyway, moving swiftly on to Banette, which is Shoppit's evolution. And we get slightly better here with 218 attack. Still not as good as Sableye, mind you. Oh, no, sorry. Still not as good as Sableye. Sableye was 141, so slightly better than Sableye on 218. You'd like to think there's been a second evolution. 127 defense. So Sableye's actually got uh, quite a high defense, as we can see. So still sort of, you know, 20 in it. And 128 stamina with a maximum CP for Bennett of 2,070. Three. So again, still pretty low, but yeah, maybe slightly more usable. We don't get another evolution for Banner until, I believe, Gen 4. So we'll have to keep a few out. And there's a bit, bit of a theme here with a few of those. We move on then to Pokemon number 355. That's Duskull. Again, a ghost-type Pokemon with an attack of 70, a defense of 162, a stamina of 40, with a maximum CP of 523. It's that's a lowly Pokemon. It's like, hmm, there's not, it's quite a scary looking Pokemon, but it's not going to be a scary Pokemon in the game. However, and then we move on to, I think, quite a cool looking Pokemon. I do like this Pokemon is Dusclops. So number three, five, six, Dusclops, again, a ghost type Pokemon with an attack of 124, defense of 234. So quite a tanky little Pokemon and stamina of 80, so quite low stamina, but pretty good defense for a maximum CP out of all of the Generation 3 Ghost types. So we're going to see of 1,335. Obviously, you know, that's single evolution. So, yeah, so that's what we're going to see. The difference for two with defenders and attackers for gyms and so on and so forth, for meta information there, Sableye being Ghost Dark is going to have double effective damage from fairy type pokemon and then things like uh ghost type so shop it etc is going to take super effective damage from ghost type pokemon themselves and dark also obviously sableye knocking off some of those problems with its ghost dark combination type so yeah really interesting stuff they're gonna be some cool pokemon so you know they're gonna look cool it's new pokemon i don't mind it's gonna be nice to have some new things to catch i'm not sure whether they're going to drop gen 3 as soon as the halloween event finishes or maybe not until next year they do have a lot of things to iron out and obviously none of the abilities have been seen some of gen 2 some of gen 1 haven't even been seen so we'll have to wait and see what happens anyway i'm going to leave you there i hope that was helpful you guys i hope you are super psyched about gen 3 if you are bang a comment comment <laughs> 
I can't speak. Bang a comment down below and tell me what is getting you super psyched for Gen 3 and this event. Don't forget to give us a like if you like this video. Do not forget to subscribe, tell all your friends. And we will see you next time for another episode of the Mystic Boost channel and Pokemon Go and stuff and more geek at heart content. See you later, guys, in the next one.